Let's meet back tomorrow, shall we? And what's the next day? Thursday. Thursday. Hello and welcome to Thursday. We're back at the airport. We're walking down to gate 65 because that is where we're going to go to O'Hare. O'Hare, yeah. And it's sometime after midnight, which is terribly exciting. Yeah. Leave at like 10. Yeah, it's going to be a while. So we're going to go down here and take a look at just kind of see, I don't know, what the gate looks like. Fortunately, this part of the airport seems pretty large. Yeah. So it looks like there's going to be some stuff to do. The problem is all the stores are going to close at like 9 or 10. We should eat and then do all of our store looking because we're going to have to probably just be on our phones for a few hours near the end and basically be really bored. We wandered around for a while looking for the various food options that were available. There's actually quite a lot around, but Burger King sounded best. I just wanted a burger. It's been a while since I've had one. And I got the double stacker, which is a lot smaller than I thought it would be. Like, check this out. This thing is, you know, only only like this big, tiny little thing. I got a Whopper. And I never really, had one before, and I didn't realize it was quite this big. I'm really, look at the- when I was hungry, the, I was like, hmm, I should get a double because it can't be that big, can it? And it was. Yeah, I'm actually a little jealous. I think next time I'd probably go with the Whopper, but, um. Don't worry, you'll probably have half this one. <laughs> maybe. Yeah, we're eating now, and God, I, I'm so tired. I'm so, so tired. I think the flight over here was like nine hours, and I slept about three of them. Um, otherwise, we watched Deadpool, Fargo, and then I started to watch season one of Flight of the Concords. And um, it it was it was a good flight. Honestly, it was a lot better than going over, uh -huh. which is good. But I'm just I'm so completely exhausted at this point. We've been up for over 24 hours with just that little, very little bit of sleep, and we still have four and a half hours to kill in in this airport. I'm just really ready to be home. So we've been sitting here a while. We're down to what two hours, I think. I think two. Oh, an hour and a half before we board. So we're getting there. I did a periscope for about 40 minutes, which was really, uh, which was really fun to do, especially since we didn't get a chance to do one in Japan. So it was fun. Um, now, honestly, I, I, I think I'm gonna ditch my contacts. I have my uh, glasses. I think I'm gonna go to the bathroom, throw my, throw away my contacts, put my glasses on, and just wear my glasses. And then we'll board in 90 minutes and go from there. We still have so much travel left. Oh my god. They're finally boarding our flight. Ready to go to Chicago? Yeah. Let's hope we can sleep on the flight. I hope so. Welcome to O'Hare. Um, we're at Stephanie's Tuscany Cafe, and this feels like old world Chicago to me. Yeah, we had to have some breakfast. So we went to a sit-down breakfast place because we were here for four hours. So we both got the same thing. Yeah. Because you copied me. I didn't copy you. I was thinking it before you ever chose it. It just sounded... I wanted to... To be honest, I just wanted to sit down somewhere. Yeah. We've been, like, on the move so much, and it just feels good to just sit. Um, it's like, what, 6.30? 6.30. We leave... Um, at like 10.15, so we have almost four hours here before we get on our flight to Charlotte. Like it is remarkable how long like our layovers and stuff are. It is absolutely crazy. You enjoying the bacon? The bacon's really good. Good. That's why I want Welcome back to Charlotte. We did it. We got our uh, bags out of the baggage claim. They arrived safely, which is good. We uh, are wandering through the parking lot. Mal claims she knows where the car is. It's up here, she says. It's uh, raining a little lightly. So I'm going to cut this short so the camera doesn't get wet. But assuming we can find... Oh, I think I actually see the back of the car. Praise the Lord. Um, once we get to the car, get all situated, Three and a half hours home. We are 
nearly freaking there. Hi, kitty cats. How are you? You look, hey, you look a little scared to see us. We probably don't smell like ourselves because we probably smell like death. As of right now, from the time that we woke up in Japan, it has been, what did I say, 45 hours. Yep. Yeah. It's been 45 hours. And in that 45 hours, we have attempted to sleep on planes, and we've done the best we could. And we got home, but man, it was, uh, that was a rough drive. That was a really rough drive. I stayed awake. But, um, it was a rough drive. Anyway, we're home. We made it. This entire place just feels unfamiliar. I feel like I've been in Japan for like an entire month. Also, it looks like we got some mail, mail while we were gone. It looks like you guys have been busy sending stuff. Thank you. Um, I give my, my dad my mailbox key so he can go get stuff so the box doesn't get overloaded. Um, now we're home. And uh, first thing we're going to do is take a shower because we smell like death. And then we're actually going to go over to my parents' house and have some dinner. One shower later, and I feel better, although I'm still very tired. But I don't, I can't smell myself anymore. Which is good because that's a problem you generally want to try and avoid. But I'm really, really tired. But we're over here. And what, what is this? Crab cakes. Mean? Crab cake sandwich? Okay. I didn't even really know. I, I'm going to be honest. I walked in and I fell asleep immediately. It's a gift. Because we we always get you something whenever we like travel. So for we, our China. Yeah. For Korea. your little, Yeah. So we got you a little something to, you know, from Japan. Oh, oh isn't that cute? Oh, mm -hmm. that's adorable. Japan loves cats. It's a luck cat. So, if they're raising, luck? if they're raising right, their their paw, right as money, left as customers. Yeah, just however that applies that to is people, so but yeah. Cute. We thought it looked like cats, so we picked that one out. That is adorable. Oh, that's so cute. Thank you guys. Yeah, you're that's welcome. Really sweet. Now you feel like you went to Japan. Well, we get to visit a lot of places through you guys. Oh yeah. <laughs> places we would ne never ever ever see, so that's really cool. And back home again. Uh, it was fun having dinner with my parents uh, over at their place. Mal showed uh, photos of the trip because she took, obviously I'm taking video throughout, but she took a lot of photos so she put them up on the Apple TV and went through them. Um, I was awake for most of it. <laughs> sleep for some of it um, and then obviously we were able to give him that little trinket um, now we're back and um, I'm very happy to say there's nothing I need to do I had everything scheduled all through Saturday with the exception of first 20 which normally comes out on Friday um, I didn't have anything ready for tomorrow and I actually asked Alex and Haley to do a first 20 I haven't watched it but they finished it up and sent it to me they did uh, Deus Ex together um, which is like Alex's favorite game so I haven't even watched it, but I'm uploading it for tomorrow, and I'm not even worrying about it. I'm going to bed. Um, probably sometime before it releases tomorrow, I'll watch the rest of it. Uh, I told them what I, <laughs> what they were, were and were not allowed to do, so I'm pretty sure it's, it's fine. And I watched the first three minutes, and it was quite good, so um, I'm sure it's okay. But they took care of First 20 tomorrow because I just didn't have time, so thank you guys. I really appreciate that. Now, um, after having been up for way, way, way too long... I'm gonna go collapse on the bed. Thanks for watching. Let's be back tomorrow, shall we?